And welcome to the home of the Buckos since 2001, PNC Park in Pittsburgh. Tonight, it's the home opener for 2017 between the Chicago Cubs and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Should see some great battles out of these two next Leading on the show. The Cubs, right fielder, number eight. Ian Happ no one, no is in to start things off as he looks at a ball to start the inning 1 and 0. Harold, we look at this Pirates ball club as they enter play here tonight. They come in looking to turn things around as they've dropped two straight. Well, Matt, I mean, the simple way to put it, they lost their last game. This is where baseball comes hey. the best to me, where all the cliches come in. You got to have a short term memory, and you really do. The game's over. You can't do anything about it. You got to come hey. back today and play better and win. Yep. And here's a slider for a called strike, and he's behind one and two now. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. Hard ground ball to third. Gung is there. No problem here. One away. Here's Jason Hayward now, and he's definitely Jason off to a fast Hayward. start in the early part of the season. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. A high fastball is in there. He might want that pitch back up and away. That's a pitch you can really drive if you have the right approach towards that opposite field gap. Swing and a liner. One out, nobody on. Very weakly on the ground, but that one rolls foul. Now another one, two. Look out, that one almost got away from him. Two and two now. Now the pitch. Hit out towards second. Played on the backhand. On to first, and there were two down. Stepping up to the plate, Anthony Rizzo. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Ball one. Well, that ball's high as a strike in the zone can go, but umpires don't like to reward pitchers on that one. They want to make you get the ball down, so he called it a ball. Throw it down, you'll get the strike. Ball chop foul right at home plate, and that evens the count at one and one. Swing and a line drive, but foul. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. He's just fouling him off till he gets something he wants to hit. Chop foul wide of first. That's four foul balls in a row. He's battling, no doubt. The one and two pitch. Rizzo out in front here as this is pulled foul into the seats and right. This is turning into quite an at bat. That's five foul balls. He's seen a lot of pitches. And an off speed pitch swung on and missed. And with that, the shot. Here's Starling Marte. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Leading off for the Pirates. Center fielder. Lays off 1-0. Oh. Well, Harold, as we take a look at the Cubs coming into play here tonight, they'll look to make it three straight here as they come in on the heels of two straight wins. Yeah, they won the first two games, Matt, here on the road. And I, that's impressive Anytime you do that. Now they're looking for the sweep. In this place, that's pretty good. A swing and a miss at the big curveball. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 1-2. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Batting second. Left Digging in, Austin, Austin Meadows. Meadows. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Sends that one out of play for strike one. A swing and a miss at the good old Uncle Charlie. Well, he's got him thinking right now. There's a fastball, then he comes back at the curveball and gets him out in front. I think when you get him out in front like that, you come back and throw another curveball right here. So he sets him down swinging. Austin Meadows becomes out number two this inning. Line drive to left. Schwarber is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the 
Standing in, Kyle Schwarber. Leading He'll lead it off here to begin the second. Kyle Schwarber. And a slider oh, just about gets away from him there as it runs in a bit too close for comfort. That swung on and missed. We're even at one and one. That's the perfect pitch after you've just brushed a guy back. The hitter probably isn't sitting up there thinking you're going to flip something soft up there. Swing and a little tapper. That's a foul ball. Now he gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Another one sent foul. Pulled toward right center field. Marte is to his left as he puts it away in the alley for the first out of the inning. Here's Chris Bryant now. He's ready for his first at bat of his early season contest. And this oh, is taken awesome. outside for bowl one. That's some good hitting right there. Great eyes. I mean, to recognize that and lay off it right now, that, that was nice. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Polanco has a read on it, makes the play, and there are two gone now. At back. the plate, Javier Baez. He's ready for Javier. his first at bat of this Baez. early season contest. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Drilled down the line. Scooped up on the backhand. And a low throw, but he's able to look this one right into the... Josh Bell the next to hit. Leading He'll begin things here against you Darvish. Cut fastball taken for strike one. Oh one count here's the pitch. This is swung on and lifted down the left field line but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now oh and two. Well now we've seen the combination of the two seamer and the cutter. That is a lethal combination because now he's taken away the ability of the hitter to sit on one direction of the pitch. And he'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. Tried to get him to chase that 0 2 curveball there but he wasn't biting. Very well could see it again here though. Here's a swing and a ground ball. to two Whoa, balls and two strikes now. Here's the pitch on two and two. Boy, good right. cutting action to that pitch as that's the first out of the inning. Standing right. in, Gregory Polanco. Right. He's ready for Gregory his first at bat Polanco. of his early season contest. Right. Now the big overhand curveball makes him swing and miss. He just ramps up and gears the fastball by him. 0 oh and 2. And then that's a pretty good example of why he's such a great pitcher. Yeah, stuff. Stuff is obviously the important key to being dominant on the mound, but it doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't have outstanding control to go along with it. But he does, and he really spotted that pitch. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at 2 and 2. Breaks his bat as this one's popped up. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. And he tries to get him to reach for it, but it stays outside. Three and two. Pretty easy pitch to lay off there, two and two. Not even close to being in the strike zone. He made it easy for the hitter in that one. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Second baseman. Darvish pauses. Harrison. First pitch on the way. Josh Harrison is in with two away here as this one swung on and missed for the first strike. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. Just a tick behind for a strike. Nothing in two count and the pitch. And this is fouled into the seats over from first. O2 nope. is a fastball that misses inside. One and two now. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. 
Ball two. Bottom of the second here with no score. Line towards center field. Hayward is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Stepping up now, Ben Zobris. Leading out for the seven, eight, nine. Bottom Short of the shot. order set to go here ben in the third. Zobris. Into the windup and the pitch. Chopped weakly to the left. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. Batting eight. Here's the, the young catcher, catcher Wilson Contreras. Wilson He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Yep, hey now. And now a pitch on the way. And that changeup makes him jump, a swing and a miss. Not too often you see a changeup come across at 88 miles an hour on the gun. Still effective when you're throwing a fastball in the high 90s, though. He's really throwing the ball well in this game. And the thing to me that stands out is that two-seamer. He's got great movement, and he's keeping hitters off balance with it. Now a swing and a miss here as he's down on strikes. So it's two up, two down to begin the third. You Darvish, Darvish is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Hey. Fastball called for strike two. He has been aggressive in this inning. 0 and 2 on this hitter. The first two outs were recorded quick because he came right after the hitter. I don't think that changes right now. And we'll have to leave it there as the play. Here's the catcher Wilson Ramos. He'll start Leading things out, out here in a tie ball game. Wilson. First oh. offering on its way. Bat explodes as this has popped up. And no one will get this one. Oh, it looks like a visit to the video room may be in order after that hack. It's 0-2 now. That was an ugly swing. And that's indicative of how they've been swinging bat today. They just have not looked like they're picking the ball up at all. He's just dominating. Here's the one and two delivery. And he had him set up perfectly there as he's not even close to touching that pitch. And on four Adding pitches, eight. he becomes out number the one. Shortstop. Adam. Frazier. First pitch on its way. Adam Frazier is at the plate as he looks at ball one. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. One and one, here it is. Checks his swing here, but he does so in time. Good check. Swing on that off-speed pitch. Clearly he's sitting fastball, ready to let it fly. He recognized it was an off-speed pitch and was able to hold up. Now a fastball. Look out as he has to duck out of harm's way there. Three ball count right now. This looks like the best chance of getting a base runner on so far. Swing and a little blooper to center. Baez into shallow center. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Digging in, Chad Cool. This guy's still looking at a zero in the hit column. First pitch coming, here it is. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. Here comes the 0 1. Swings through it for strike number two. Hey, Matt, you're the pitcher. There's two outs, nobody on. You're letting it fly, right? I'd be doing the same thing like he just did right there. Two big swings, and he has nothing yet. Too low with a fastball there. One ball, two strikes. Darvish pauses. Here's the one and two. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. Here's the pitch on two and two. Breaking ball just misses the inside corner. Boy, went from being in the driver's seat to now being in some trouble. Had the count 0 and 2, started nipping at the corners. And we'll have to leave it there as this is. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Ian Happ. 0 right for fielder. 1 for him here in Ian this one. Happ. Hot shot on the ground is short. Frazier is there. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Ready for so another batter. chance. Shot Jason Hayward. He's Jason 0 for 1 Hayward. thus far. There's a well hit ball out to right center field. On to second goes Hayward. 
And he'll pull in there with a one-out double. Digging in for his second at-bat, Anthony Rizzo comes into this at-bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Still all zeros in the run column here in the fourth inning. Dan, does this continue or does somebody score here? Oh, you have to let you know, Matt, we have so many of these games that are 12 to 10 and 9 to 8. It's nice to see a low scoring pitcher's duel for once. Over the outside half, and it's two and one. That's an impressive pitch right there. If you're willing to throw a changeup on 2 and 0, oh, that tells me that's a pitch you feel really confident with. And a slider runs in on him as he has to lean out of the way. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But this will wind up foul as he runs the count full now. No walks yet. Here's the delivery. Good battle continues as this ball's chopped foul at the plate and the count remains three and two. Payoff pitch on its way to first. And that's through into right field for a base hit. Fortunately, the bobble won't cost him a run as runners will stick at first and third. Digging in to try it again. Kyle Schwarber flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. And the slider swung on and chopped foul right at home plate. It's strike one. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Marte ranging back at the track. He leaps, but he can't make the play, and it bangs off the wall. And they're going to take a one-nothing lead as the run comes across to score. Riding in once again, Chris Bryant. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. This one's down to third. And that's through into left, a base hit. And a good throw is going to hold that runner at third. So they're loaded now with only one away. Second baseman. Here's Javier Baez. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Look out, a fastball up near his dome, and that'll wake you up a bit. Well, giving up hits is one thing, but judging by that last pitch, he doesn't have any consistency with his release point right now. He doesn't know where it's going, and he knows it. Putting himself in a pretty bad situation now on 2 and 0, and the base is loaded. He basically doesn't have much of an option but to challenge him right here. Three and oh now. He's set. Here's the 3 0. -oh. Leaves a slider up high, but it's taken for a strike. Taking all the way there, and a walk could be huge here. So I wouldn't be surprised if he's got the bat on his shoulder again on the next pitch. High in the air out to center field. Marte is under it. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he's safe. He safe. Now in the box, Ben Zobris. And we'll see what he can do here. Two on, ben two away, two Zobrist. home so far this inning. Hoping to limit the damage. Here's the pitch. Line drive to center field. And he will run this one down as he pulls it in around the letters, and the inning is over. Digging in, Starling Marte. Leading on he was a strikeout victim in his first try. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And a whiff at a good slider that time. And a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. Well, you're in trouble at the plate if you fall behind this guy, 0-2. So that was a good job to hold up right there. And this is fouled back and out of play. Ready on one and two. And this is swung on and missed. And this fourth inning will start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout. And there's one away. Left fielder, Austin Meadow. He's set and the pitch. Lifted the other way to left center. Hayward giving chase. He gets there, and that's the second out. So digging in now, Jung Ho Gong 16. hit it hard, but lined out in his first half bat. 
And this pitch is up and in as he backs away. It's ball one. Still a little bit early to be worrying about this, but in a two-run game, a two-out walk right here could at least get the tying run to the plate. And on top of that, there's some pop on that on-deck circle. Well, not a great spot to be in right now. 2-0 to a great hitter yeah, well. like this. This is when you really have to pay attention as a pitcher. And if you have good off-speed stuff, this might be the time to start mixing in your off-speed stuff. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Zobrist onto the grass. He makes the play. A great. Here's the young catcher, Wilson. Contreras. The catcher, number 40. Wilson. Contreras. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Chopped in front of home plate. And the fifth yeah. inning will start with a ground out, one away. Up now to the plate, you Darvish. Petra. He's 0 for you 1 thus far. Oh. Up and in there with ball the first one, pitch no fastball. Play. It's ball one. Now the pitch. Ball, ball two now. Out. Tell you what, pitching to the pitcher is not that easy. Sometimes when you face him, a little bit of a letdown. He's in a 2 0 count right now. You got to really focus, I think, more so with the pitcher hitting against you than anybody. And he'll lay the fastball in here to get the count back to 2 and 1. This is in the air out to straightaway center. Marte is under it, and that's the second out of the inning. Digging in well, once right again, here, Ian eight. Happ. Ian he started out the evening Happ. 0 for 2 so far. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And you wonder about the control now as he misses high with the slider. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. Hey. Takes a knee high fastball. Two out, nobody on. And this one runs a little too far in. Bowl two. Inside with the slider, and that'll back him up a bit. Well, he doesn't have any walks yet. He's going to have to come in the zone right here and really avoid throwing that first walk of the game. And that one's taken outside for a ball. He walked him. So no one, two, three inning here. They've got themselves a two out base runner. Center fielder, Jason Hayward. First pitch of the at bat. Runners off for second. Lifted the other way out to left center. Calling for it, Meadows. And that ends the inning. Josh Bell, the next to hit, comes Leading into this at Pirates. bat 0 for 1 in the ball First game. Baseman. First oh. offering on its way. Oh. Now, this is chopped, fouled at home plate. It's 0 and 1. And now, a pitch on the way. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. A little bit off the outside. It's one and two. Here's the one and two delivery. To two balls and two strikes now. Two two. Here it is. Skied into straightaway right. Half sprinting after it. One out. Stepping into the box. Gregory Polanco. He looked Gregory. to bounce back Polanco. after striking out his last time up. And he lays off there 1 and 0. The 1 and 0 delivery. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. On the move is Hayward. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Josh Harrison stands five, in. Hit it hard baseman. but lined out in his first at bat. Darvish pauses. First pitch on the way. And a whiff at a good slider that time. Comes set and the 0 1. And a ball popped foul to the right side out of play. Boy, Matt, he's in some kind of groove, and they better get something working because he is one pitch away from throwing five shutout innings. Talk about dominant work so far. And he struck him out, his eighth. Ready once again. And some action now in the 
Barrett's bullpen. They've got a lefty and a right-hander up to throw. Ball hit high and foul down the left field line. It's strike one. Oh, that looked like a pretty good pitch to hit. It's a little bit late, so he might have been just fooled just a tad bit, just enough not to square it up. Swing and a ball hit on the ground. A dive, but he can't get a glove on it. It's through for a base hit. Digging in and looking for more, Kyle Schwarber. He's one for two in the ball game. First pitch coming. Here it is. Hit hard to short. And that's through for a hit. Here's Chris Bryant now. He's singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Chris Bryant. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. Liner toward right center. That gets down. He's got himself a base hit. Rizzo rounds the corner and is headed home. The runner scores from second. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Riding in once again, Javier Baez. Number 57 gets the call from the bullpen to pitch in relief. Now pitching for the Pirates. From the stretch. Number 57. Nope. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Well, these hitters can expect to see a heavy dose of that big fastball from this reliever. It's a major part of his arsenal. And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2 0. Zero. Mm, much too quick on the trigger there. It's 2 and 1. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. On a good pitch there, had him stretching to get out there, and it's two and two now. Well, he was clearly looking for a fastball right there, and that slider got right to him, went whoop, slid to the side, and as a result, he got an ugly swing and miss. Under this one is Harrison, and he's got it for the first out. Here's Ben Zobris now. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. Ben Zobris. First offering on its way. The nope, fastball outside. here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. One oh count. Here it is. And here's a ball hit in the air. Gong in foul ground. And no one will track it down. Hit to first. Bell brings it in, and he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. Ready for another shot the now. Wilson 40. Contreras, third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Way Zero. off balance hack that time. Good for the first strike. Wow, not sure what that was, but talking about having your mind made up, you're going to swing before the pitcher even throws oh, a pitch. I don't know how you swing at that pitch. A great job of changing speeds there. It's 0 and 2. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And the runner from third crosses the plate. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. Now a 5 nothing lead. The pitcher, Ready for 11. another chance. You mm -hmm. Darvish. Darvish. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. And he runs it in on him and gets him to swing through it for strike one. He's going to need to shorten up and get that foot down a little bit earlier if he hopes to be catching up to that fastball. Sliced hard but foul. Look out over there. Now a swing and a ball popped in the air back behind short. Frazier is there. Digging in for his second at bat. Wilson Ramos. Leading 0 for 1 Pirates. for him here in this one. First pitch of the at bat. Wilson. A fastball Ramos. and he swings through it to oh, fall one. behind. He's set. Here's the 0 1. Now a swing and a ground ball. But uh, this will get foul for strike two. Trying to send him packing for the second time. On the ground to the left side. Throws in time, and that's out number one. And that'll bring in Adam Frazier. He's 0 for 1 thus far. First delivery to him on the way. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground.
Nothing in one count. Here it comes. And here's a ball hit in the air. Zobrist is there for it. And he makes the catch for the second out. So coming to the plate. Number 57 is getting his first plate. Corey Dickerson will get the call to pinch hit here as we'll see what he can do with two out and the base is empty. Hard hit ball to second. Throw in time and the side is retired. Kevin Segrist will come on and make his fourth appearance. Number 41. Stepping in and ready for another shot in half. He'll be tasked with starting things as we begin the seventh. He goes the other way as this is hit in the air toward the gap in right center. Under this one is Polanco, and he's got it for the first out. The batter, so stepping the in, fielder. Jason Hayward. Jason it was Hayward. a flyout for him in his last trip. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Down the first baseline. A dive, but he can't get it. It's through into the outfield. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. Two hits and three at-bats for him in this one. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Lined hard toward right center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one-out double. Digging in once again, Kyle Schwarber. He's two for three thus far. Albert Almora will be called on to pinch hit now, and he'll do it in a golden RBI spot as he's got two men in scoring position with only one gone in the inning. Weak chopper up the line. That rolls foul for strike one. From the belt, the pitch. Oh, he looked like a caveman swing and a club on that one. It's 0-2 now. Oh, man. He just tied him up in knots right there. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. Ramos gathers it. He makes the throw to first. Two down. Digging into try. And again. Third baseman, Chris Bryant. First pitch coming, here it is. A changeup floats outside here for ball one. Matt, I'm looking down at the bullpen. There's nobody getting up. This is his game right here. I know he's in big trouble, but he's going to have to suck it up and go get him. And here's a curveball that just about got away as it misses inside for a ball. Down low, and the plot thickens here. Three and zero. Oh. And remember here, there's an open base at first, so a walk is not the worst thing that could happen right here. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Swing and a miss as he was way early on that one. Three and two. He swung so hard. I don't know how he stayed on his feet or kept his helmet on. I'm surprised he didn't fall down. He swung so hard. What a big swing. Hit hard towards center. That's in there. Base hit. Throw away. Yeah. Get him. In to score. The runner from third. Now a good throw in. will hold that second runner at third base. So they're at the corners now with two away. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Lifted in the air out towards left center. After it is Dickerson. He gets there to make the catch. And that ends the inning. It's time for the... Here's Starling Marte. He struck out twice Leading thus far, so we'll see if he can fare any better Center here. Fielder. First pitch Starling. on its way. Way in front of a great slider that time. One thing you try to do as a hitter is figure out what pattern the pitcher is pitching. I can't cover the whole plate. He's done a masterful job of pounding them on the outside half for strikes, and they haven't figured it out yet. Almora is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first. Out. David Freeze will move into the on deck. The Pirates, number 23, David 
three. Zero. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. Well, that's another first pitch strike right there. Now he's over 70% so far in this game. First pitch strike to hit him. That's why he's deep in the game right now. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0 and 2. Here it comes on nothing and two. Line drive to center field, and that's a base hit. So the perfect game bid ends in the seventh. Digging in, Jung Ho Gong. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. First offering on its way. Now a swing and a hard hit grounder. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Hayward has a read on it. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. And Hayward will put this one away for round number two. Digging first in the switch hitter, 55. Josh Bell. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. First delivery to him on the way. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Gregory Polanco, 0 for 2 on his line thus far. And now the Cubs' bullpen will start working here as both a lefty and a righty are up. He's set, here it comes. And this is going to be a foul ball. Two runs on two hits, and no errors so far for the Pirates. Swing and a miss, and he's in control, 0 and 2. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine. Michael Feliz place. has been summoned from the now pitching for the Pirates into the box. Ben Zobrist. He'll have the Michael first crack Feliz. at it here as we start and inning number eight. For the Pirates. Now and he starts to go yeah. after it. Question number was, five. did he hold up in time? Number yes, five. indeed, says the third base umpire. 1-0 count. Here it is. Lifted in the air to shallow center field. Marte is under it. One down. Digging in, Wilson Contreras. He drove home two with a single in his last plate appearance. And he's in front of a tight little slider that time. The 0-1 delivery. In front of the changeup, and he can't keep it fair. Two strikes on him now. Got him swinging. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. The Stepping batter. up now, Edwin. Hugh Darvish. Your attention, Fourth please. plate appearance for him tonight, and why not? Darvish. He's been in control Number all two. game long. Tommy LaStella. Line drive to left, and that's in there, so perhaps some life here with two men out. So the two-out hit keeps the top of the eighth inning extended. The right at the plate, Ian Happ. Ian Happ. First delivery to him on the way. And here's a ball hit in the air. Gong is there for it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Pedro Stroke is on now to pitch out of the bullpen. In the bottom half Number of the inning. Pedro Stroke. And this ball is going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. 0 oh and 1 count and the pitch. A little bouncer. That winds up foul for the second strike. Hit on the ground to third. Bryant's got it. One away. At the plate, Wilson Ramos. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And this is fouled back and out of play. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. There's a fastball that just misses. Ball one. 
He's set. Here comes the 1-1. On, oh, he'll try to take control of the inside part of the plate with the fastball as he backs him off a bit. Not sure if that was a purpose pitch or not, but I like it. As a pitcher, sometimes you've got to be willing to back the guy off the plate by running something hard inside. You can't just let guys be comfortable standing in the batter's box against you. Now batting. And that'll bring in Adam Frazier. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul. So a missed opportunity there. He's ready. Here's the 0 1. And a good job to lay off the fastball there close, but it's 1 and 1. The set and the 1 1 pitch. Foul toward the third base dugout, but this will get back into the seats out of play. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 1 2. And another foul ball. Now a swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. Here's another one two. And he chased it in the dirt. The throw to first is in time and the inning is over. Into the box now Jason Hayward. He's doubled and singled in four at bats in this contest. Jason Hayward. Into the windup and the pitch. Swing and a liner. Foul. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. And that misses 1 and 1. Here it comes on 1 and 1. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. Into the windup. Here's the 2 and 1 pitch. High in the air into shallow left center. Dickerson's there. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. He's got three hits, including a double to this point. Mine to the right side. Throw gets him. Two down. Stepping up to the plate, Albert Almora comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Ground ball left side. Gunn's got it. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Stepping into the box, Corey Dickerson will be the one to get us going here in the bottom of inning number nine. Number 12. Brian Dunzing will come on and make his fourth appearance. Number 32, Brian Dunzing. Mm, a little tardy there. No balls and a strike. Well, that is a good pitch. A sinker down with that kind of movement, it is really hard to hit. No wonder he swung and missed. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one. And now a pitch on the way. Swing and a ball hit in the air to right field and deep back is the right fielder, but he will look up and watch this one sail out of here. In now, Starling Marte. Over three with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. Brandon Morrow takes the ball now in inning number nine. Looking to close. It looks like the Cubs will get a left hander up and working out of the bullpen. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. The wind up and the 0 1. Grounder down the line at third. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Line toward the alley in left center. And that'll make him one for four in this one. The pitcher. Michael Feliz steps up to the plate. Francisco Cervelli will come on to pinch hit now with a runner at first and nobody out. Line toward right center, and that's in there. Base hit. And they keep rolling here. Their runners at the corners with still nobody out. And that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gung. Not providing much out of the three hole in this one. Hitless in three at bats so far. 
Just a tick behind for a strike. Matt, this could be a real special end. They've already hit a home run here, and now the real power is starting to come to the plate. We might be in for a light shift. Oh, Off the plate and in. It's a ball and a strike. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to 1-2 and two now. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Again, he sends it out of play. From the stretch. And that swung on and fouled straight back. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And this is going to get down. Extra bases, and they're starting to make some inroads here. One run is scored. Here's a second runner around third. But no, he'll put on the brakes and head back to third. So striding in, Josh Bell, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Justin Wilson comes on now in an awfully difficult situation as there are two on here with nobody out. Justin Wilson. Now a swing, and he just fouls this one away. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0-2 now. Here's the 0-2. And a neck-high fastball that time. It's a big spot right here. Two runners on, and you knew he was going to waste a pitch right there, 0-2. But right now, you can That's still open. make him chase out of the zone, and you got a chance to get out of this jam. Fly ball out toward right field. Half giving chase. And the play is made, but this should be good enough for an RBI as the runner from third tags up. They'll cash in here as the run is in to score from third. Oh now at the plate, Gregory Polanco. They'll go to work on getting that tying run home from second. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. This is going to be an interesting at bat. I think he has to be pitching for a strike out here, so we'll see what kind of sequence he uses. Here's a late swing and a miss, strike two. As a look, now the pitch. In under the hands with a fastball, it's one and two. Working for the punch out and the offering. Now a foul tip, but it's held onto behind the plate, and that'll go down as a very important now out number two. Second baseman. Now time is called here as we'll get a trip to the mound. Carl Edwards Jr. takes over on the mound. Now as he'll try to get the number six. Carl Edwards Jr. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. Josh Harrison stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. A one count. Here's the pitch. Ball one. That's not an easy pitch to do anything with, right? 96 miles an hour in on the hands. You almost have to be looking for that pitch to be able to do anything with that. Swing and a miss. And with that, the Bucks are down to perhaps their final strike of the ball game. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. In front of the change up there is this is chopped foul at home plate. He'll try again. One, two. Struck him out. So he'll strand the possible tying run at second. And a great job of working out of trouble as this ball game is over. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance. Kept the opposition at bay. And as a result, he's our tops player of the game. Hey, look at the numbers. This is what you want from your starting pitcher. He gave him seven strong innings and sets things up perfectly for the bullpen to seal the deal. Very good job out there. Here now is the final line score tonight. First for the victorious Chicago Cubs. Six runs on 12 hits. No errors. They left seven men on base. For the Pirates... Five runs, six hits, no errors. They left one man on base.
Time of the ball game, three hours and 30 minutes. 